Product sketches look good on paper, but do they always pan out in reality? This is episode three of our mini series, Behind the Product, where we take you on the journey of bringing our latest innovation to life, the Powerbase 4. So we had the final sketch. Now it's time to 3D print a prototype to see if it made sense in real life. Simple enough, right? Wrong. After modeling this in CAD, we sent it straight to the 3D printer. After 15 hours, our first prototype was here, but it was a fail. The size, too small. The hinge, it didn't feel strong enough. There wasn't enough space to place AirPods and other devices on the wireless charging area. So we tweaked, tested, and rebuilt. And with every change and update, it made it even better. And after a few weeks of modifying and reprints, finally, it was perfect. But the next challenge, a working and fully functioning prototype. We worked with our engineer team to make sure the internal components would integrate seamlessly with our design, including our custom-made retractable cable. This was a long, tedious process, but finally, we got a package delivered. At last, it was here, a fully functioning prototype. And everything worked perfectly and looked exactly how we imagined. Now that this was done, the next step was to officially start custom tooling at the factory. And to do this best, we knew we had to fly to China. 